everyone this is another do-it-yourself project that I'm gonna be doing today is to help to stain this little wooden bench and it doesn't need a lot I wiped it down sand it a little bit so it's ready to be stained or painted and I'm using a gray color stain and it looks similar to paint so let's see how this comes out and it's all wood and it's really sturdy so I'm gonna show you how to do that So this is going to be a cute little um, chair for a little kid because it has little heart shapes on it and it's very pretty. So all it needed was a little bit of color which I'm adding to it and it's looking great. So as you can see I need to do more on the sides more so I'll let you I'll show you in a little bit how it when it's finished. Okay, welcome back guys. This is what I'm gonna do with the little gray chair that I painted earlier. So I've never done this before, but I'm gonna try my best. I'm gonna be drying a sunflower on the chair. So first I'm gonna make a circle with a pen. You won't be able to see it because of the dark, but I hope you can see that circle. Um, that will be the center of my sunflower and so I'm gonna be making some patterns here like a hairdrop for my sunflower so I'm gonna be um, using like little um, I would say ovals like this shape for the patterns so let's see how that goes using some um, craft paint acrylic from Michaels so that's what I'm going to be using so I'm going to be mixing them but first I'm going to try to see if I can do it freehand okay. and then I'm using a tiny little brush with small little bristles Then I'm gonna put a seal on it.
the sunflower. I hope it looks like a sunflower, but again, this is the first time I've done this. I'm not a professional artist. I just try my best, and you can do it too. Okay guys, and this is the end result of my project. Doing that sunflower on the seat part of the um, chair. And it's all finished and dried. Um, again, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so. And you can see my other do-it-yourself projects on there. And hit the thumbs up. Thank you for watching.